Hey superstars, I'm Sue and welcome to my channel Reviews with Sue. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back and supporting our channel. If you're new here, welcome. I'm Sue and hope you're considering that subscribe button. So would you like to know what today's unboxing is all about? Well, I have some products to share with you from Timu. And if you want to know what's inside this big old bag, then just keep on watching. Doing reviews just like I do. Hanging out with your friend Sue. It's Sue. What time is it? It's Timu time it is. This is going to be another collaboration video with Timu and all the items I'm about to share with you today were gifted to me from them. So a huge shout out to the Timu team for working with me once again. If you've never heard of Timu before, I don't know where you've been, but if you haven't, it's an online store website that sells deeply discounted items. It's a lot like Amazon, but personally myself, I feel their prices are so much better. Now I am an affiliate of Timu, which means I have an affiliate link. If you've never downloaded the app on your phone before, you will receive 30% off your order. Now there are going to be some ceilings on that. So double check and read the, you know, fine print of course. And you're also gonna receive a $100 bundle of coupons that you can use for future purchases. I am gonna leave the affiliate link down below in the description box, as well as all the links to the items I'm gonna share with you today. And what else do I need to tell you? Oh, I have a discount code. It is FAV07236. And you wanna use that when you do your checkout. And even if you've already downloaded the app before and you're just shopping there and you do it all the time, if you could actually, in the search bar, type in my discount code, which is FAV07236. And what that will do for me is let Timu know that you are actually finding things from myself, if that makes any sense. Hopefully it does. Now, Timu prices. They range all over the place. So I'm gonna quote you the prices of when I picked out the items, but when I look at the normal site, I see these items are a lot cheaper than that. So don't, you know, quote me on the prices I'm going to be giving you today. So all their information is gonna be in the description box. If I have any giveaways going on, it's also gonna be linked down below. And I know I do have some. Now this bag I am filming the day before I go on my European trip for three weeks. There's some items in here that I wanna take on my vacation with me. So I am actually wanting to get into this bag. Now, you might not see this video to the tail end of my vacation. I may even be back from vacation by the time you see it, but I gotta film it because yes, they did send me all these items over. So if you are a Timu lover, anything like I am, please consider hitting that subscribe button because I've got lots more Timu videos coming your way. So let's go ahead and get into this bag. I had to give my little spiel first at the beginning. So let's go ahead and start off with this item right here. This was $16.99 and from what I can tell, it's all sealed up. So I'm going to have to cut into the bag here. And I believe this is going to be my new travel pillow or blankie, something like that. Is it a pillow or is it a blanket? I kind of forgot. Maybe it's like a two-in-one. But this is what it looks like here. Now it does come in several different colors. It does have like a little back pocket here so you can actually slide it over your, you know, your um, carry-on suitcase if you have one. And it is very soft, I have to say. I, for some reason, thought there was gonna be like a little plane or something on here. But this is very soft. Let's see. Oh yes, I can definitely fall asleep on this. I think our flight is gonna be, we have a two hour flight from Sault Ste. Marie, Canada to Toronto, Canada. That's like two hours, I wanna say. And then from there, we fly to Rome. And I wanna say, my husband said that was like about a nine or maybe a 10 hour flight. So I'm definitely be gonna be getting some Z's. We are leaving our home at 4.30 in the morning and we're not gonna get to Rome until the following day at 11.30 because they changed our flights and we have a eight hour layover in Toronto. Who knows what we're gonna do for eight hours in Toronto in their airport, but we'll figure it out. So you wanna see more about this pillow? Well, I think when you open it up, let's see here, there is a little zipper right there. And when you unzip it, yes. Oh, this is really cool. Okay, so you don't have to like wrap it up specially or anything. It has a soft, fuzzy blanket on the inside. So you can use it as a blanket or you could also use it as a pillow. And then it does have a little carabiner right here. So then that way you can attach it to your carry-on or to your backpack. And I don't believe that this actually counts as like one of your carry-on items from what I understand. That's what I've heard from others. And then another item I have is this one here. And this one was $8.49. And this is going to be for a set of four luggage straps. So there's all pretty colors in here. So what I want this for is to keep my luggage together, of course. I kind of messed up. We bought new luggage last year and we bought soft luggage. And now I'm really wishing that we would have bought that hard shell case. Let me know, what kind of luggage do you guys like to use? Do you have like the, the soft stuff or do you have like those hard shells? Because I think that's personally we should have gotten. 
but I'm gonna wrap this around my suitcase. So you know, when it comes down that conveyor belt, uh, yes, I think these colors are going to grab our attention and we will know which bag is ours. What do you guys think? So you can actually put one like around this way and then I think you can put one around the other way. Now I do have one more team haul that has some more items that are like travel essentials in it. In fact, I even ordered a travel carry on suitcase and that hasn't come yet. And we have one more day to get mail. So fingers crossed it comes. If it doesn't, I do have other luggage, but it was a hard shell one and I just loved the style of it. So I can't wait to get my little paws on that one. So you all pray with me that it comes in time, but if it doesn't, we'll be fine. So our next item is this here. This one was $5.99 and I believe this is going to be a passport cover. So this is what it looks like. It does come in several different colors. First of all, it has a, a little zipper here on the back. So if you want to slip like just your ID or something like that in there, you could. There is a front pocket if you want to keep your passports ready to go. Then when you open it up, you can, what? What can you do? Well, there's a little piece of foamage here. And then you can also stick your passport. So if like you have a family of four, you can put all their passports and just line them up in here. Then on this side here, it looks like there's little slots where you can put little credit cards. And then there's like little baby, like plastic little pockets right here. I'm wondering if those are like for memory cards or something. And then you also have like a little baby zipper down here that if you want to, you know, tuck some change in there, you could. And let's see here, is there a pocket? Uh, no, there's no pockets on the inside, but there is another zipper. So let's see if I can show you that. There's a zipper there. And yeah, so you can actually, you know, put some money and stuff inside there. So very nice. I'm sure I'll be taking that with me. Okay, then next I have is this item here. This one was $6.49. And I wrote here on my little sticker that it is RFID. So this is something where, you know, people that are trying to steal like your credit card information and stuff, they can't actually get a hold of it. So let me get this guy out. So let's see here. Oh, I can't remember. Did I pick this up before? No, this is a different one. I actually picked one of these up in a previous haul, but I think it was more for like if you're going on walks and stuff. This one is larger, as you can see right here. It has two pockets on it. So what I'm planning on doing is giving this to my husband. So then that way he can wear this underneath his clothes. So let's see here. Because they say that the crime over there is, you know, pretty high. So there is like a back pocket zipper right there. Inside here, there's two little mesh pockets. So you can actually like tuck money like in these little pockets. And then you can put like your passport or something like in that area or your phone. And then there is a, another pocket. Let's see, let me open it up. Oh, and the zippers work really good. And then there is another pocket right there where you can maybe, you know, put your cell phone in. And then let's see here. There is this little, I don't know what this is for though. It doesn't go through. Hmm. There's this little thing right there, but I don't exactly know what that is. I don't know if it's just the symbol or not, but yeah, it does say RFID, stop. Yeah, that's what it says, right over here. And then the back of this is mesh material and it's actually kind of soft. So I don't think it, it'll help be it like more breathable, make it be like more breathable. Does that make sense? Uh, no, but a lot of times I get so excited, I can't make any sense, but more breathable. And this way it won't like stick to my husband's skin because it's gonna, he's gonna like take his shirt and put it over it, I'm pretty sure. So very nice. And of course it is going to be expandable. So let's see here. So this one, does it have a little, oh, it does. It's very slim, I like that. So this is the disconnect right here. So you just push it and it comes off. Oh, I think he's gonna like this because the one I was showing him that he was gonna use actually had like a thicker like buckle on it and it was kinda, he said it was fine, but this I think he's gonna like a lot better. So then when you wanna put it on, you just push it together, maybe. Maybe you gotta pinch it. Yeah, you gotta pinch it just a little bit, I think. Hmm. Huh. Wait a minute, why won't this go back on there now? Hmm. Let me get it. Now, if you happen to hear a lawnmower go by, that's because it's my husband. He's actually, it's the day before we leave on our vacation. I'm filming a bunch of videos, so I have some content to go up while I'm on vacation. And so he's out there with the zero turn or the tractor. I don't know, he's got one of those things running around out there. And then the strap on this is really nice. It's actually elastic, so it does stretch a little bit right there. Plus, you can adjust it to, you know, whatever size your waist is. Yeah, I like this because the other one doesn't have this, ex, you know, expansion right there too. So, you know, it can go around you and go underneath your shirt. Nice. I think he's really going to like that. Then the next item I have is this one right here. This one also is going to be that RFID. This was $2.99. And this one is for me because, yes, it is pink. 
And this is just a little baby wallet that you can use and put your ID in here. You can put a couple of credit cards over here. The flip side, you can put a few credit cards. And then there's also going to be a little pocket right here if you want to, you know, tuck a little bit of money in there. Yeah, I like it. And then you know what else is really neat? It has this little, um, like a thumb thing here where you can, or not for a thumb, for whatever finger. But if you have like your license or something in there and it's hard to get it out, you can actually like push it up from the bottom here. Sometimes I can remember, I used to work for a bank and there was a customer that came in and she showed me her, you know, her little wallet. And she said, because we were talking about how hard it is to get, you know, credit cards and stuff out of there when you're like out shopping. What she did is she put a little piece of tape on the end of her credit card and like folded it over so then she could just pull on that little piece of tape and the credit card would come out. And I thought, oh my goodness, that is like such a clever idea. All right, moving on to one for my hubby. So it's exactly the same thing, but his was $2.99 as well. But this one is going to be in the black color right there. So I guess I could take it out of here because I'm going to give it to him to use anyways. And then he's going to be double protected because he might put this inside this. So it's got RFID. It's got RFID. So he is doubly, you know, protected. And there's that spot where you can put your license in there or whatever you want to put in there. And then you've got your slots for your credit cards. Plus it has that little push through slot right there at the bottom. So yay. And what else do we have? I have this item right here. This one was $4.49. I have been watching so many videos on traveling to Europe and what people are recommending. Even, I mean, these items you don't have to use just in Europe, of course. You can use these for any type of travels or some things you might just want to use in your everyday life. Well, this is actually a phone stand or you can use it for your iPad. And Oh, I was going to bring my husband's phone in. Oh, no, he's actually using it. I want to have my husband's phone. But anyways, the way this works is it bends. So what you can do is you can bend this to any shape that you want, like this, and then you can cradle your phone right inside here. Tell me that's not clever. If you have an iPad, you can do the same thing for that too. And then when you're traveling, this will actually go in your carry-on very smoothly because it's nice and flat. So you can just kind of like slip it into anywhere. Yeah, I like it. And then what do we have on here? It looks like we have a airplane. We have some suitcases. We got a bus. And we have, is that a violin or a cello? Tell me below, what, what is that there? I think it's a violin. Or is it one of those big things that people go like this to? Okay, I can't remember what the name is, but if you know, let me know. So we have that right there, which I think is pretty cool. Now you can see why I wanted to get into this before I actually went on the trip. Okay, now this isn't actually technically for the trip, but I'm gonna show it to you anyways. Um, I've actually hauled this before and I really liked it. So it comes in a pack of 100. So there is gonna be 50 of these little cardboard sheets and then there's actually 50 little envelopes right here. And if you make jewelry and like resell jewelry or anything like that, you can put your jewelry pieces on here and then you can actually put them in the little plastic baggie so it's like all nice and beautiful and presented. I do make some jewelry myself and I've sold some of it in my recent garage sale. So I thought I wanted to start making some more jewelry or if I'm just gifting it to someone, you know, it's just like looks, the presentation just looks so much nicer. Okay, then our next item is going to be $1.49 and this is the little item here. Now, what I want this for is, again, you know, I'm just watching all those channels out there and they're saying, you know, do this and get that and try this. And, and I'm like, okay, I'm not going to Amazon to look for it. I'm going to look up for it on Timu and see if I can find it cheaper there. And their prices are so much better, at least in my eyes they are. Now, this is going to be for a set of, is there four? Let me see three here. I thought it was supposed to be for a set of four, but okay. Well, apparently I lost one. But these are silver. Did, they, did I drop one? I don't know. Well, it's a little baby, like... I don't know if this is considered a carabiner or not, but what they recommend is, I was gonna bring something to demonstrate it too. So let's see, it's not gonna work on this, but there's two little clips on here. So there's a clip on this end, and then there's a little clip on this end here. So what you wanna do is if you have something like, say you're out doing tours and you have a backpack or whatever it is you have on your back, and there's two zippers, and you take those two zippers and you zip them together. Then you can do is take this little guy right here and you can clip it to each one of those zippers. So if a criminal tries to get into your backpack, what's gonna happen is they're not gonna be able to open it because they're gonna have to take the time to try to squeeze these little guys open to get inside the backpack. I mean, they might just steal the whole backpack, of course, but this will actually help prevent them from getting into your backpack. So that's why I wanted to grab a few of those. And I think that is gonna be very handy to have. And then I wasn't sure what color I wanted, so this one, I actually picked black. So I have a black set and I have a silver pack. And how many is in this one? 
Well, it's so weird because there's three in here, but my package here says that there is going to be, it says black five. Well, maybe they only come in a set of three, but this particular size is five. Now, again, I am gonna leave all these links down below in the description box. So if you wanna check these out for yourself, you definitely can. And I believe too, if you use my links, I might receive a little kickback. And if you ever use any of my links or you even sign up for Timu using my affiliate link, please let me know in the comment section so that way I can thank you personally. I do my best to get you every single comment. I know I read every comment. I always heart it and I try to say a little something back. Even it's like, thank you so much for watching because without you, I wouldn't have this channel and I wouldn't be having this much fun. Now, next item is going to be $2.99. And these are going to be a roll of 100 stickers. And let me see here. Let me, because you know, I just love stickers. I, I just had to get these because it's a little pink truck and it just says Happy Mail on it. So I just thought these would be really cute just to, you know, put on my friend mail or put on my giveaways that people win from me. But I just thought it was so cute. Isn't it adorable? <laughs> it is adorable. All right. What else do we have in here? Okay. Next item we have is, come on, let's see here. Ooh, this is a big one, but I thought I had a smaller item. Oh, here it is. It was like blending in. This is the next item right here. This one was $10.99. And this is actually for my plane ride because this is supposed to go on the back of the seat in front of you. And let me see how this works exactly. Hmm, how does this go? Now this is supposed to go over your food tray. Oh, okay, I think I'm getting it now. So you know how you have your food tray in front of you, right? Well, this somehow or another is going to have a little back pocket. See the little pocket here? I think this slips over that food tray that's in front of you. So then this is what you're gonna be looking at right here. And inside here, there is a pocket right here, a pocket right here, and then a big pocket right here. Now I know um, most likely I'm going to be like editing my videos while we're up in that air for that 10 hours. I might be doing a little snoozing with my little blanket, my little pillow over here. But I like to have all my things like right in front of me. I know my husband's gonna wanna read his book because he um, doesn't sleep well on planes, so he might be doing a little bit of reading, but after sitting around that Toronto airport for what did I say, eight hours, he's probably definitely gonna be wanting to do a little bit of sleeping while we're flying overnight. But I just thought this was really neat, and I thought it was a great suggestion that somebody had on one of their channels. But yeah, this is what it looks like. So it's got a pocket, a pocket, a pocket, and then on the back side, this is supposed to go over your food tray. Or, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's gonna go over your food tray because you're not gonna wanna like interrupt the person by putting it like over the back of their seat because they're not gonna want this thing to be leaning against their head, I don't think. So, isn't that nifty? Yeah, and it's very, you know, it's small, it's light. I can fold it up really small like this and I can just stuff this in my carry-on. You can see you can fold it all the way up. So, that is definitely gonna come in handy. And then, I think I'm on to my last item in this haul. Yes, my bag is empty, but I got a big one right here. Now, this particular item was $38.99. And this is like a travel backpack. From what I understand, I like to say that a lot. Only because and if I say something wrong, I'm kind of covered. So, it does come in a nice little dust cover. And this did come in several different colors. I'm kind of anxious to see it. Now, I'm hoping that I can use this as a carry-on item, as like my personal item. I'm going to have to do a little bit of measuring. But this looked really, really cool. So this is what the front of it looks like here. So let's start from the front. So first of all, you got a zipper. And let's see, there's a pocket. And this pocket is like a triangle shape. So it only goes to like right about here, I want to say. Okay, then let's see. Okay, what else should I get into next here? Then it looks like there is a zipper here on the side. So I'm going to zip this down and it just goes straight down. And then inside it, there is just one big long pocket. So you could probably put like, Maybe like, oh yeah, it's pretty big in there. I want to say it's at least like 11 and a half by 14, if I had to guess. So you could put like folders in there or paperwork or books inside there. But then you can close it this way. And then here is the side of it here. Now this has a pocket right here. Oh, and it expands. There's elastic right there, as you can see. So if you got a water bottle, you can slide it in there and it will expand. Let's see if I do it this way. You can see it kind of like expands or so it might get a little bit bigger. And then there's also, nope, I thought this might here be a pocket, but this is just stitching. And it looks like the stitching looks very nice on it. And then let's see here. So that was one side of it. Then you've got your other side here. And it looks like here, you have a charger right there. So it does have a built-in charger. 
And then this is the back side of it here. And on the back side, you've got your, you know, your backpack pieces. And then let's see here. Okay, so then here it has a little buckle. There's a lot to this bag, you guys. Man, oh man. So it does have a buckle there. So that's gonna expand it. It has a buckle there on this side. Whoops, come on. And that will expand as well. So then you've got like this wide here. So this is where you can plug in here for a USB charger there. And then let's see here now. Okay, so I did that side. Now let's do this side. And it looks like too that you can actually make this strap here a little bit bigger or a little bit smaller if you needed to. And now we have it opened up. So now you can kind of see how wide it is here. This looks really nice, you guys. This has a nice foam handle on it here. And then, all right, so now let's see, where are we at? <laughs> where are we? I'm, I'm looking for a zipper. Okay, I found the zipper, I did. All right, so over here you have two zippers actually. Okay, so there's a zipper here and there's a zipper here. So technically, remember how I was talking about how you could zipper these together? See how there's like a little opening between these two right here? There's one here and one here. So you could take that little baby carabiner that's got a clasp on each side, put it between those two. Now I know it's gonna be difficult to get into it once it's all like tied up and everything. But what we plan on doing is like keeping our money and the stuff that we want like close to us. Like I've got my little Lululemon um, cover right here that I'm gonna be wearing across me, which is gonna have my phone and stuff in it. But then he's gonna be using this little bag here on his stomach. So basically, we will be covered for our phones and for like my chapstick I'll be putting in my little bag, you know, just little things. And on the backpack portion of it, that's where we're gonna keep like other things like maybe our chargers and we'll keep our like selfie stick in there, maybe an extra pair of shoes because you know, we're gonna be probably doing a lot of walking. So I might wear start off with sandals and then have my tennis shoes in the backpack. So the odds are we won't be getting into this that often. Okay, so now that I explained that, let's go ahead and open this up. So it opens up here and then it opens up here on this side. And then you've got basically a little mini office inside here. So inside here, you can see is where you can actually plug in your um, power bank here and then you can charge from the outside of the bag. Isn't that cool? So you've got your little area here where you can charge your, put your power bank here. And then on this side here is where you can plug it in and do some charging without actually like getting into your bag or leaving it in your bag next to your charger. You can be still hands-free. And then inside here, we have an intersection that has a zipper here in the back. Here, am I showing it to you? So there is a zipper pocket, which is a very deep pocket. My whole hand's fitting in there. All of this is cushioned all the way around. So if you put your laptop or anything in there, it's gonna stay nice and protected. Then, I'm not sure. Oh, oh, I think I know what this is. So then you've got this little extra bag, which I'll get to in a minute. And then on this side here, you actually have a zipper that is mesh that you can see through it and you'll know exactly what's in there. So if you wanna put some pens or pencils in there. So that's what's on this side. So now we close it here and then there is a, another zipper here in the back. And if I'm not explaining this very well, I am so, so sorry. So back here has a zipper. Oh, actually this is probably where you could put your laptop and then you can put all your snacks and all your extra stuff inside this pocket over here. So yeah, this is the part that's gonna go against your back and that is nice and big. It's cushioned on this side and it's cushioned on this side so it's gonna protect your laptop and it is a very large pocket. I don't know the exact sizes of this. I didn't like research all that, but the link's gonna be down below in the description box. Cool, so you have that. And then at the bottom, there is a secret little panel down there. So down here at the bottom, there is a little air vent. I don't know if you can see it, but there is a little air vent right there. And when you open this up, let's see here, I'm gonna unzip it. All these zippers are working great. Inside here, was that bag I was talking about. So if you wanted to, you can put your stinky shoes inside this bag and then it will be ventilated here through the bottom. So that was like a really cool bag. Man, I'm so excited I got into this because I really wanted to see how this worked and I had not even touched it or felt it until right now with all of you guys. So hopefully I explained the bag nice enough to y'all. Now it did come in several colors. I was kind of hoping this might be a little bit more tealer, but it is kind of like a, I want to call this sea foam, sea foam green is what I'm going to call it. And I do like the color. I just wish it was a little bit more brighter and vibrant. But if it was, you know something, it might show dirt a lot faster too. It did come in several different colors. It came in pink and white, gray, black, 
I don't know if it came in like a regular green. I think it came in sky blue though. So a huge array of different, you know, colors that this one came in. So that was the last item in my haul. What did you guys think? Do you love everything? Do you like everything? Any of these items that you might be able to use at home or even on an upcoming vacation. If you are going on any vacations this summer, let me know where you're going. Maybe, maybe I'll see you there. Because I think we have, I think we're going to Florida again, but I don't think that's until the fall time. And then we're going to on some like local weekend getaways. Like we're going on a walk, uh, a golfing weekend and we're just, we're just having fun and being retired. So thank you, Timu, again, so much for collaborating with me in this video. Again, all these items were sent to me free for review. I was able to pick out all the items myself. As you can tell, I'm super excited about everything that I picked out. And I do have that discount code FAV07236. If you don't mind, if you could put it into your search bar, it'll take you to my homepage and it might show some of my favorites in there. And if you go shopping from there, I might receive a little bit of credit from that. And in Timu's eyes, they'll see that people are like watching my videos and they're using some of my links. And then even when you get to the checkout, try throwing my code in there, see what actually happens. And if you're brand new to Timu and you download the app for the very first time using my affiliate link that's gonna be down below in the description box, you will receive 30% off your order. And I do believe there's gonna be a ceiling on that. Oh, and I forgot to mention, you do have to do that within the first hour of you downloading the app. Now, a few other awesome things about Timu. What I absolutely love is they actually offer free shipping, free returns up to 90 days, and they even do price adjustments up to 30 days. However, you do have to request it. And if you do have any questions about that, please ask me in the comments below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Like I said, I'm going on a three-week vacation, but I am going to try to um, get to some of those comments in my spare time if I can. I did buy an online, or I bought like their Wi-Fi on the cruise ship, which was very pricey, but there's no way I could go 10 days on a cruise ship without actually like watching some of my friends out there or seeing what's happening on my channel. And if you get a chance to watch any of my other videos while I'm gone, I would really appreciate it. And leave me a little comment. And even if it's just a star emoji, then that way I know that you stopped by to visit me. So thank you all so much for putting up with me for the past almost 30 minutes. I so appreciate it. And if I have any giveaways going on, okay, one last thing. If I have any giveaways, it's also gonna be linked down below in the description box. So thank you again from the bottom of my heart. Please be safe, be well, and I'll see you in the next video.